News from the Bay Area, the state, and the globe. This is SPC Today. Welcome to SPC Today. I'm Jason Dykeman. Recently, three Florida schools were recognized by the U.S. Department of Education as 2012 Green Ribbon Schools. Hillsborough County's Learning Gate Community School was among three Florida schools recognized for their commitment to the environment. The Green Ribbon Schools Award Program was established this year to recognize a school's exemplary achievement in environmental impact, health, and education. Winners of the Green Ribbon experienced national and local press coverage, enhanced community support, and private financial assistance. SPC Today reporter Susan Tellman joins us for a story on how one international charity is getting the Bay Area walking. Susan? Thank you, Jason. Each year, communities work alongside the American Cancer Society to host Relay for Life events. Many consider these events life-changing as they celebrate the lives of people who have battled cancer. Come springtime each year, flowers blossom, days get longer, and people begin walking to support finding the cure for an illness that has affected all of us in some way. Relay for Life is an international fundraising event to find a cure for cancer. But Relay for Life is more than just that for those who participate. It is a way of grieving your loved ones as well as supporting those surviving cancer. It was all about people in my life that I had lost. It's safe to say that everyone knows someone who has been affected by cancer. Everyone knows someone that has had to hear the most difficult news ever. I was with my husband in the emergency room when the doctor walked in and said, your husband has cancer. And I said, that's not possible. And his only goal was to live long enough to be in Relay. <laughs> Everyone at Relay for Life is looking for a better tomorrow, a tomorrow where someone will find the solution to the problem so many of us struggle with every day a cure for cancer. All right. And he just we'll knew someday All right. a man in a white coat would find the answer. And it didn't work for him because we battled for three months and we lost. But somewhere there's a man in a white coat who might find an answer for the next person. Every Relay for Life event is made up of teams, each of which has a purpose for walking. 2002, my late husband passed of cancer. We had a support group called the Frogs, Friends Rallying Optimistically for George. We would try to develop a theme that centered around finding a cure. And that's what all the, the fundraising is about. It's about a cure. I'd like to take a moment. Many Relay for Life events are happening in your community during this time of year. Event organizers encourage everyone to join a team today at RelayForLife.org and start walking for the cure. Thank you for that report, Susan. That's all for this week's edition of SPC Today. I'm Jason Dykeman. SPC Today is a student production of St. Petersburg College in partnership with WEDU.